Hello, this is Johnny Good. Uh, I'm the one who created the videos out at blog-videos.info and today I want to show you how to add Google AdSense ads to your new WordPress blog. Um, as you can see here, I'm using Google ads just to monetize my site just a little bit. Um, I've got them here on the be very beginning of each post and I've also got them out here on the sidebar. So these uh, ads actually show up on every page. Um, these ones up here in the post don't show up on my my home page they show up on every other post page um, now there's one easy way to add AdSense ads is to go out to wordpress.com and find a free plugin that will allow you to um, just put a little bit of code right here at the beginning of all of your posts and that will automatically uh, add your AdSense ads uh, to your posts. I'm not going to show you how to do that today because all of the plugins come with really good tutorials and they show you exactly how to do it. Also the plugins tend to become obsolete if you update to a new version of WordPress and a lot of the the ones that have been used a lot lately have are no longer uh, functioning because the WordPress has been updated. So what I find is easier to do actually is to do it manually uh, although some of the new uh, plugins work really well so um, you can do it either way actually the what I'm going to show you first is how to put the Google AdSense ads here in your sidebar uh, and it's really easy to do first of all you have to have an account with Google of course and you would have to have gone through the process up here on their uh, AdSense setup and just follow through uh, keep clicking on all the links you want to choose one that's 120 in 20 pixels and however deep you want I think the two options are 240 pixels and 600 I'm just choosing a short one uh, but you do need to uh, choose one of the skinny ones to go up and down the vertical um, um, versions because otherwise they won't fit in your sidebar so go ahead and control C and, col and collect all of this information here on the script and then go back out to your blog and go to presentation and widgets takes just a bit of time for it to come up and you'll see that you have uh, options here when it says text widgets it allows you to have as many as you really want so you would just choose uh, to increase the number if you don't have enough text widgets yet I've got another video out here on how to use the widget so if you're not sure about how to do that go ahead and click on one of the other videos and it'll show you um, and then you what you want to do is you want to add a text widget to whichever space that you want your AdSense ads to show up I've got mine at the bottom of my sidebar if you wanted them up to the top you would just um, move it it's really easy to, <laughs> it's, it's really easy to do so I'm just going to leave it down here at the bottom and then you would click on this little edit button and you would go up here and you would um, paste your ad into the text bar don't put a uh, a header up here um, be, just simply because Google doesn't like you to announce that you've got ads and it doesn't want you to say anything like sponsored by or click here or any of those things so um, just to uh, go along with their requirements just go ahead and leave that blank it's easy to do and then all you have to do is click on the save changes button and then as soon as um, that's saved it might actually take just a few minutes for Google to spider your site to um, to see what's on it before your um, before your uh, AdSense ads actually show up when you first click on that view site this space may actually be white but it will show up eventually it just takes a few minutes for Google to figure out what it is that uh, your blog is talking about now the other way uh, to, if you wanted to use my system now this is my home page as you see if you want to use my system that allows you to have AdSense ads only on the posts and not on on the um, but not on the post as they show up on your home page then you just um, I'm going to show you how that looks again I, I'm going to click on the permalink to my post and you can see right here is where my AdSense ads show up at the beginning of every post I don't have to add a piece of code uh, to each one of my posts that happens to be one of the things that I usually forget to do and then I have to go back and uh, edit my post so I just uh, got a little tired of that and I decided to go ahead and add 
the Google AdSense ads automatically so that they show up in every post whether I remember to put one on or not. Um, now that's um, fairly easy to do. You would go out to your presentation and your theme editor this time and then you would choose the single post template out of your theme files and you would go down to now th this actually changes with some themes uh, that you would need a different template or a, a different page to put this on sometimes it takes just a little bit of experimentation but on this particular theme the single post template is the one I need and you would put it right right before the div class entry and that's going to put it right in between you, the post itself and the title of your post so here you can see that I have copied and pasted my Google AdSense script and I pasted it on here and then all you need to go do of course is to hit the update file now if you have manually installed WordPress it may uh, give you a little error notice saying that we could have edited if you had changed the permissions on your f on this particular file um, and that is only going to be required if you've manually installed it if you have a um, if you've got a blog that has been automatically installed through your hosting account the way HostGator does then all of these files will be automatically writable and you'll be able to update them uh, without making any changes in, with an FTP program. Um, I think I've got another video out here on how to change the permissions. I'm not really sure. If I don't, I'll, I'll go out and make one real quick. <laughs> but anyway, if you've had it auto your blog automatically created through your hosting account, you won't need to mess with that. All you need to do is click your update file after you've added the uh, Google AdSense code, and then you'll go out here uh, to see your blog, and you'll see it showing up here right underneath the um, the top information on your post you'll you'll see the title and you'll see the author name and w which category it was under um, and then you'll see your uh, WordPress blog so anyway I'm not your WordPress blog you're gonna see your Google AdSense uh, I hope I hope this helped um, if you want to make just a little bit of extra money this is the way to do it um, I actually think that the uh, new paper play uh, is going to be a better way to monetize your blog but for right now um, uh, most people are using Google AdSense still and this is this is a really easy way to get them on your WordPress blog um, I hope this helps uh, again come back and visit me at blog-videos.info anytime that you'd like to learn a little bit more about customizing your new WordPress blog thanks for visiting bye bye